Welcome to Johnson & Wales Library, the best place for students to study. The library is equipped by computers, printers, and copy machines that students can use every day. It also has study rooms where students can get together and work on their projects. Students come to the library every day because it means a lot to them and they feel comfortable studying, doing their research, doing their homework, working with their classmates, checking business journals, borrowing books and printing their assignments. According to the survey we conducted in both library campuses, 49% of students said that they are very satisfied with the environment of the study area in the Down City Library, compared to 35% who are satisfied with the study area in Harborside's library. I think library is a very convenient place for me. Um, it opened for a long time and it's by my house. I can come to here to meet my friends and study. And anytime I want to print out my information or data from school, it's very um, convenient. Um, for me, the library is a place where um, I can go to get my homework done. Uh, I am a commuter student. So uh, I see it as a place to go in the middle of the day is in between classes. If my classes, for some reason, I have a break in between classes. I might go get something to eat at one of the uh, dining facilities on campus or off campus. And then uh, I'll come here and do some homework. And, you know, I can, the good thing about this place is that you can go and study in a quiet area. Or if you have a group project to work on, you're not shunned away because every, this quiet is strictly no talking. You know, like right here, we're working on a group project, and, uh, you know, we can talk about ourselves without anybody feeling it. Yeah, I find it pretty interesting because, you know, it's, it's less noisy as compared to other places, quite obvious. Uh, I come to the library pretty much every day because I have a lot of homeworks, and I spend pretty much most of the time doing homework here in the library. Uh, the reasons I come to the library are, uh, to do, uh, to mostly copy uh, assignments for other classes and to check my email and uh, print various uh, attachments from uh, my emails that I can't print because I don't own a, a printer in my apartment. What, what the library means to me is it means a lot. Um, everything is here, all the books and stuff. I can usually come here whenever and find books I need, look up info. Magazine is always here, newspaper. Mm -hmm. Mean a lot, you know, all these books and everything. And um, I don't have a computer in my room, so it's very useful. Uh, Sometime I came here to take a rest after class, or I go to downstairs to read magazines about hospitality. All right. Well, I'm back at the library. I'm uh, I'm here every day almost, except the weekends, of course. Gotta take a little time off. Uh, you know, I come here to, to study and to print out all my, my stuff just because it's easier. Um, you know, getting to the online database is a lot simpler and I have the resources of the librarians around me uh, if I ever need any assistance. So I come here and I study and, you know, I also uh, booked a a quiet room not too long ago and for a project and that actually uh, worked out pretty well so the library to me it's more of a place where I can actually focus uh, because I'm one of the kids that is uh, easily distracted. I love the fact um, that we have people, students, and staff from all around the world who use this library um, I learn something every day um, from people all around the world. And I wish that more people would use the library. I wish more people would, would know about us and use our online resources and come to the library. The Johnson Wells Harborside Library um, is unique. Uh, we have culinary students. We have international students from all over the world. We have students of education. So we have a very diverse population. The library is open from 7.30 in the morning until midnight, so for any student, uh, no matter what they're studying, 
Uh, there is a time when the library is open and convenient for them. We also do instant messaging uh, reference service, which the students really enjoy. Well, the students enjoy coming here because of our staff. We'll find any uh, answer or for them. We have tons of databases that we subscribe to for the students, which help us as tools. Uh, we train the students how to find the, the information. We also have like I think 30 uh, computers over here, mm -hmm. which totally get filled up sometimes. Forty percent of students are very satisfied with the equipment available to them in Down City Library, while seventeen percent are very satisfied with the amount of equipment in Capital City Library. So I think that the library needs to have more computers. More computers. More computer. More computers. More study room. More study rooms. Study space. Wireless printer. A printer. A printer. Mm -hmm. When the library is busy, students have to wait much longer to use a computer. to put frosted, uh, a frost on the glass windows out here so there'd be less distractions between the people walking down the hallway and the people inside the library or those people in the library looking out into uh, the hallway. Uh, study area with a uh, discussion area. Then study area students won't be disturbed by the people who is discuss their project. There is absolutely, if you come to the downtown library, there is absolutely no graduation desk book. You have to go all the way to Herbal site. Most of the times, uh, I need to work on projects. We have projects, we have homeworks. When there is like a very high affluent, all the computers are busy. So I believe that we don't really have, uh, compared to you know uh, our necessity, our needs, it's not really enough. The newspaper racks around here. Mm -hmm. The uh, sometimes the computer there's not enough computers for instance. And all these books are culinary books. Could be other books, you know. It would be, be nice if there's other books. You know. Just hope that more that when people come to the library and have a good experience, that they will tell their friends and tell their classmates how helpful we are and what wonderful resources we have at the library. We try to reach out to the faculty and other staff at, at every opportunity. So I just hope that the word of mouth brings more people to the library. And I think some of the challenges uh, that the library faces uh, are uh, an increasing need for space, uh, mostly seating and meeting room space. And so we've kind of outgrown um, the projections uh, that we made for this library very quickly. Um, 
we need additional um, equipment. Uh, we, our printers are running from morning until night, and our copy machines, our computers. So if someone wanted to um, give me uh, three wishes on something that I could wish for for the Harborside Library, um, I would say uh, more equipment, uh, more space, and uh, more professional librarians to serve all the students who come into the library. More study rooms too. More study rooms. Yes, yeah, absolutely. Okay. Thank you so much for um, listening to our story about the Harborside Library.